Hell, if we've been honest, maybe even years on how I want to be remembered. I feel like no one knows the real me, like the real shy. Some days I don't know what I want to do or even what I want to wear, but I do know who I am and you will too. I have story times for days that taught me so many life lessons and ain't no telling what you'll see on a weekend vlog, child. Welcome to my channel. Hey y'all, what's up? And we banging in with vlogs. I said vlogs. <laughs> Vlogmas videos. Oh my God, y'all. This is like my last final video. This is like the last, well, it's not. I'm gonna still record for Christmas Eve and Christmas, but y'all, it's almost over with. It, it's almost over. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. So you guys, I decided to do a little story time. This is probably going to be one of my last story times in a minute, okay? So, by the title, we got stranded at a Q's party. Okay, I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to even start the story, y'all. I had to be like 20, 20, 21. I, it had to be 20, 21. I say 21. I had just turned 21. Okay, so everybody don't need names in the story. I'm gonna just give two people names. Um, one girl, her name's gonna be Ginger, and my best friend in the story, her name is gonna be Kennedy. Ginger and Kennedy. All right, y'all. So this is way back when. Um, my best friend Kennedy at the time, she, um, she used to go to Georgia State downtown and it was around the time that it was, scratch it bro, scratch it. Before I even get to the story, make sure you guys like, share, comment, and subscribe because yeah, <laughs> only if you guys want more content like this. <laughs> Anyways, so like I was saying, so my best friend, she was going to Georgia State at the time and um, she had this roommate. Her name was Ginger. And see, me, Kennedy, and Ginger, we all went to Gordon together. So, I met them at Gordon. But me and Kennedy was best friends. And Ken Ginger was... Damn, does this sound so confusing? But Ginger was Kennedy's friend, if you get what I'm saying. And they were actually roommates at Georgia State. So, we planned this weekend, y'all. I kind of remember like we was getting our outfits together we was saying like it was like two weeks before we was all like we're gonna have a good time homecoming coming i said homecoming coming that <laughs> homecoming is coming and we're gonna have a good time we got our fits ready like we was like saying well you know like just imagining all the things we were gonna do we couldn't wait we couldn't wait couldn't wait so somehow i think we had to go pick someone up I'm trying to remember how it was somebody somebody had to get picked up and they had to get picked up all the way in Gwinnett so we had to ride all the way to Gwinnett and pick somebody up it was like a group of five so it was three of us in the back and it was two of us in the front so we went to go pick them up we getting ready so we got our liquor i think we had some patron back then i was just drinking anything that got me lit at that point like <laughs> i really didn't care so um we got dressed um we planned on going to this cues party um they was having it in some kind of building you guys like i think this is my first ever cues party i've ever been to and let me just tell you we had a time that night <laughs> Boy, we had a time last night. Boy, we had a time last night. So, we all get in the car and, you know, this has been so long ago, so don't even judge me if my memory <laughs> ain't there. But I'm going to try. So, um, we all get to the car and um, the building was actually hard to find, hard to find. But we found the building. So, we go to the party, all five of us. And, um, if you've been to a Q's party, you already know. They is some wild boys. Like, I didn't even really realize Q's, like, got down like that. I was in there, like, 
And then, like, I'm so, at the time, I was not even as thick as I am now, baby. I was a little skinny, petite, small girl, okay? So, like, the guys, they kept trying to pick me up. I was like, what are you guys doing? Me and my friend, we, it's like, me and Kennedy, we, like, locking arms. And then this other girl locking on, so we just like holding each other down, like, you ain't gonna pick us up, you ain't gonna pick us up. <laughs> like, don't touch me, sir. So, like, that, like, really, I was genuinely scared of the cues, okay? But we ended up having a real good time, like, we got real lit, the party was real fun. And I think what ended up happening was <laughs> the police came and shut that down. So, after that happened, one of the cues was like, hey, come back to our, what do you call them? So, what? A fraternity house. Come back to the fraternity house. We finna have, like, a little kickback. We was like, okay, cool. He gave us the address. So, um, we get in the car, and we're riding. So, Kennedy, not Kennedy. Kennedy's my best friend. Okay, Ginger, she, she's like, you guys, like, um... I can't wait till we get back and um we have we're gonna have a girls night because we did plan to have like a little girls slumber party weekend little night after we got back you know from partying and we was just like okay and you know me and Kennedy in the back of our heads we already had plans so we was all we was both talking to people and um we was all like well when we get back we finna hit up what's the name what's the name yeah, that's what we finna do and um but ginger she was just so excited about having this girls night but if you know you know like who wants to at the end of the night after drinking a whole bunch of alcohol who wants to end up sitting around their friends and just smiling at each other nobody nobody so we get to the party well we get to the fraternity house and there's nobody out there it's just all guys just standing out there and we're just like we're not about to go in there so we just sitting outside in the car and we're just talking about you know what the next move may be so ginger's like okay guys um i guess we can go have our song party and me and Kim be like um no actually we're not having this mama party. Um, we got plans after this. You know, our booze are gonna come see us. And I was like, yeah, um, catch y'all next time. Our booze are gonna come see us. And at this point, Ginger, she gets mad. And Ginger and Kennedy, they kind of get into it. And Kennedy was all like, you just mad because you ain't got no to go to. Da -da -da -da. And Ginger was all like, we had this plan. And y'all are not following through with the girls' night. And I'm just sitting there like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And, and by the way, the other girls that were in the car, they was closer with Ginger than, you know, me and Kennedy was. So, we're just like, oh my god, oh my god. So, Kennedy, like, they're going back and forth a little bit. And I was just like, Ugh. And Kennedy gets out the car. She kind of storms out the car. So, of course, it's my best friend. So, I'm going to follow after her. Like, bro, are you okay? So, um, can Ginger them, they decide to go ahead and ride on off. Not to mention, y'all. Y'all, we are in the middle of Atlanta. We in the hood. This fraternity house is in the hood. I never thought that girls would get so mad that y'all didn't want to have a girls night in the summer party and he 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 ha ha all night with them. I didn't know they would get so mad about something like that they would ride off and leave you in the dark with a whole bunch of cues in the yard. So yeah. <laughs> So we're just looking at each other like I can't believe they pulled off but I really think I kind of remember um Kennedy she was like you know what she was all like y'all can go um y'all we're gonna call it Uber anyway but it was still like but we really didn't expect them to leave so soon we thought they was gonna wait until our Uber got there they just left us so we're just sitting there stranded so, I'm looking at Kennedy. She's looking at me. I'm just like, bro, I guess we got to call an Uber. So, she called the Uber. 
so i don't remember what went on but it was some things going back and forth on instagram on twitter <laughs> it was just so catty but at the end of the day me and kennedy we we seen our booze at night we seen our booze because it's just like bro after drinking all this liquor i do not want to sit up in y'all face i don't i don't so <laughs> we ended up chilling with our booze still but yeah they had fell out just for a little while they didn't fall out for a while a long for a long time they ended up being friends again which is quite funny ginger and kennedy they are friends i think they're still friends right now um i'm not friends with none of them <laughs> so i i really i really couldn't tell you guys the relationship statuses of any of these friendships but yeah, that was a quick story about the time we got stranded at the Q's party. And it was so crazy because Kennedy was the one that picked up the girl from Gwinnett. So, and Kennedy was supposed to take her back to Gwinnett. I don't know how the girl got back home. Because <laughs> we didn't take her back. Because <laughs> we had got into it. But yeah, you guys, that's the story time about how it's time. I got stranded in the Q's party. Um, my story times don't be that long because half of the time I can't really go into detail because I really don't remember, bro. I don't remember. <laughs> I really don't be remembering. So thank you guys for watching. And if you like my story times, give me a thumbs up. If you don't, give me a thumbs down. Do some. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for guys for watching. Bye.